Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Welcome to another episode of my GM featuring Sam Hankey. It's going down today. I have over 10,000 BC and I'm willing to blow that. I'm not blowing it in the strip club, I'm blowing it on these special abilities and attributes. It's going down, man. It's time for Sam Hankey to get these upgrades. We're going into a new year, though. Check it out. I'm going to fast forward things so quickly. I'm not going to go all the way into the trade deadline. I'm actually going to go until January 1st. And then I'm going to play from January 1st to January 17th. So I'll be playing those games off screen. And you guys will probably see some nice highlights from the Sixers and whatever teams I do play. But what I can tell you guys is I want to move along a little bit faster. Uh, we only have a few weeks until NBA 2K15. And with all the news that's been coming out lately, man, I just kind of, I'm, 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 pu I'm pushing myself to play 2K14, if you know what I mean. You know, if you played it like I've played it, you would know the struggle of playing 2K14. And it's like that every year. Every year I've been going to team up and getting a chance to get my hand on the next gen game or the next game in the cycle. I just get so bored with the, <laughs> with the other one. I'm like, ah, you know, it's like biting your nails trying to play, bro. I'm telling you. But check this out, man. I'm upgrading my emotional intelligence all the way to level six. I need to get the special ability. I'm going to try to get all the special abilities before the new game starts. I know I'm not going to make the level 70, man. I'm not I'm not that guy. It'll probably take me two to three seasons because I'm not buying VC. Um, I think I told you guys in the last video, I'm actually using my NBA 2K14 app on my phone to get VC. If you guys don't have that app, I don't know. Y'all been losing all year. So, you know, that's the app where, you know, you go in, you press the little mailbox and, you know, you get a little bit of VC for your troubles. I haven't been having the time to actually go to the park and play a lot of games, man. Destiny and sims 4 have been taking up so much of my time um i haven't even been having a chance to play man like that's how crazy it is like but i've really been having a lot of fun with these games man it's it's like that time frame and period where i play a lot of different games and you know even though i don't make series out of them i have a lot of fun playing off camera because it seems like every game i grab you know during the summer up until the fall it's like oh i gotta make a series on this oh, i gotta make a series on that so you know i kind of gotta be perfect I got to have the commentary right. I got to either be on camera, off camera, you know, and I know I know how you guys are, man. I know y'all be wanting these videos because <laughs> uh, I've seen the success with the EA Sports UFC uh, series where I was dropping them joints like two a day, three a day. Y'all was loving that shit. Loving that. But I might do that for 2K. You never know. I might do five minute quarters. What y'all think about five minute quarters for 2K15? Is that cool or not? Five to eight, maybe. Uh, whatever. I see what I can do, but check this out, man. I'm upgrading these levels, man. It's levels to this stuff, man. And I still got about 4,000 and some chains VC. So I'm going to upgrade as much as I can to get as many abilities as I can. So, you know, Sam, he can, can be a beast. And uh, just to let you guys know, every episode that goes down, we do have Sam Hinky mode turned on. So make sure y'all, you know, stay tuned for this Sam Hinky craziness. It was a lot going on because like I told y'all, I'm going to be simming it until the 1st of January. So it was so many things that came up, man. Dudes was coming off injury, going on injury. Teams was coming to me trying to take my draft picks. You know what I'm saying? I was hitting them with that blocker. You know what I'm saying? You know, I put, I, I went in my iPhone, went down to their name, added on the block list and everything. It was crazy. It was crazy. Y'all definitely going to want to watch this, man. I'm telling y'all. But I'm just, you know, using this VC as much as I can. I know it's kind of crazy because, you know, Playing this game and then doing the commentary afterwards kind of weird because you're like, well, what can I talk about? I don't know. I'm just wing it. F it. I'm going to wing it. <laughs> nah, man. But emotional intelligence is getting a nice little upgrade here. I made it past level 30. Uh-oh. Doing my thing. You know? But um, check this out, man. I will tell y'all that Sam Hinky got downright wild as well as doing a whole bunch of crazy stuff like Yo, he admitted to doing so. You know what? I'm going to save this for y'all, man. He did. He, he almost made World Star. Like, real rap, he almost made World Star. That's how crazy this episode get. Are y'all ready for some Sam Hinky mode or no? Are y'all ready for some Sam Hinky mode or no? I'm just saying. Because I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's simulate, boy.
Hi Sam, I just wanted to remind you that if you want to make any changes to player roles, you can open up the player roles menu where you can adjust anyone from the roster. Alright, so let's check and see if I need to change any player roles. I think so far, the guys are pretty happy with where they are. Arnett Maltry is injured, Sims is injured, Jason Richardson is still injured, so... You know, everybody's pretty happy, but I know when Richardson comes back and uh, Sims comes back in the lineup, a couple dudes are going to be pissed off. But I think um, I'm good with where Noel is. And uh, Thank you, Mike. I think I may use this a lot. Always happy to help. All right. Let's simulate the next game. Let's do it. What's up, Sam? I have some fantastic news for you. Arnett Maltree has now fully recovered from his sore knee injury. Do you want to adjust the rotations? Great news. Let the head coach know and he can get him back into the rotation if he wants. Yeah, man, I'm starting to let Brett Brown take more interest in the team. Sure, I'll let the head coach know. What's up, Sam? I have some fantastic news for you. Henry Sims has now fully recovered from his bruised tailbone injury. Do you want to adjust the rotations? Yay, we got our 56 overall back. Nigga, please. Great news. Let the head coach know and he can get him back into the rotation if he wants. Sure, I'll let the head coach know. All right, let's simulate the next game. Uh-oh. Message. My phone call is ringing. Minnesota's on the phone, on the line. What they want, what they want. Hey, how are you, Sam? I have a trade proposal that I'd like you to look over. This nigga guy. Are you serious? Mabai Muta, ain't that some sh This boy is, you know what? I can't even take it, 2K. Y'all really trying to give me the trades that the Sixers actually took? And you want my second round draft pick? Are you out of your goddamn mind? I'm not giving up James Anderson. I don't care. No, I'm not giving him up. I need him. He can shoot threes. Sorry, Wayne. I'm not looking to deal at this time. That's okay. Maybe we can work something out another time. What's up, Sam? I have some fantastic news for you. Jason Richardson has now fully recovered from his broken hand injury. Do you want to adjust the rotations? Man, if you keep asking me to adjust some rotations, god damn. Let the coach handle that shit. I'm the GM for the sake, man. The guy about to slap this. Awesome news. But there's no need to bother me with this from now on. You can let coach know this is his responsibility moving forward. Thanks. I will pass this along to head coach. All right, finally. Now that that's out of the way. Let's catch these L's. Oh man, somebody else calling me? Hey Sam, I have a trade offer for you that I think you might be interested in. <laughs> Are you fucking out of your mind? You think you're going to get my first round pick, bitch? Man, I, you know what? I ought to slap the hell out. This is why y'all having problems over there in Los Angeles now. You know what? End call. Hang up. Sorry, Casey. I'm not looking to deal at this time. Dude, just with the dumbest tree. Oh, man. That's okay. Maybe we can work something out another time. Hey, Sam. I just wanted to remind you that if you want to make any changes to our staff, you can open up the staff menu where you can hire new staff members, extend their contracts, initiate conversations, or even give them a swift kick to the curb. Oh, sucky sucky now. I get to fire everybody? Oh, yeah, this might be, like, one of my final moves at the end of the season, right before the playoffs. Right when they find out we ain't going to make it to the playoffs, I'm fine. Every goddamn body. Everybody got to go. I'm sick and tired of this shit. I'm tired of you. I'm tired of you. I'm tired of you. I don't even know who you are, and I'm tired of your punk ass because you keep coming to me with these dumbass injuries. You know what? It's Mike Smith. Get the fuck out of here. I'm tired of you. You sound like a... You know what? I can't take it. I can't take it. I can't take it. Mm-mm. I, I can't take it. Thanks for bringing this to my attention. I'm glad I could be of help. Please remember that if the thought of ever firing me from the staff menu crosses your mind... Oh, crosses my mind. Oh, it crossed my goddamn mind. I might kick it to the curb real fast. Son of a bitch. You know what? I'm sick and tired of this boy. He got a nice little smart mouth on him. Oh, yeah. I'm going to make him be a hot dog boy. 
Walk up them goddamn bleachers, mother... Mm. Hey, Sam, just checking in. And I thought I'd mention that you can change the prices of items sold in the concourse. If you're interested, check out the game pricing menu. Oh, you know what I'm interested in? I'm interested in you passing out popcorn and cotton candy for the rest of the goddamn season. I'm sick and tired of you. I don't care if you're the assistant GM. Do something. Why do you keep coming to me with all these problems? Shoot, you know our team is losing. You know we're not doing good. We're about to go on a five-game losing streak. You know what? I'm lowering tickets. I'm lowering parking. I'm lowering hot dogs. I'm lowering soda, ice cream. You know what? I'm about to make something free 99. I cannot take it. I'm sick and tired of this, man. We need some. We need to put butts in the seats. I mean, I'm sick and tired of 10,000 fans showing up. I'm sick and tired of it. Not even 10,000. People don't even come to the pregame. They're not even watching us on TV. The ratings is down. Comcast Sports Network is about to drop us. They're about to drop us as a whole team. How are you going to end our contract just because we're ass? I just can't take it. Thanks, Mike. This should be useful moving forward. Let up can be of help. When you are setting prices for tickets, merchandise, whatever, how concerned are you with great value to the fans versus making money? Do you want me to come in that goddamn audience? What you mean what I think? Of course you know it's a goddamn business about this money. Shit. Well, I can't help it. We can't get nobody in these goddamn seats. You know what? Get out of here. You just go, bitch. The most important aspect to this franchise is our fans. Making sure that families feel like they can get a great value at a game, that's a top priority for me. I just lie my ass off. Mm. Just to get the fans in my corner. I'm so devious. So devious. It's all right. Oh, and the coach trusts me now. Hold up. Hold up. Tonight's loss makes five straight. Something isn't working here. Any idea what it is? Oh, I'll tell you what it is. It's the goddamn players. It's the goddamn staff. All these dudes is ass out here. The only players that's good on this team is Noel and Michael Carter Williams. Everybody else can eat a dick. That's the way I feel about it. These niggas are ass. Shit. What you, what you expect? I built this team. I'm the one people should be pointing their fingers at. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Sam Hinkie, he's doing so bad right now, man. Oh, God. You got, wait till you guys see my teams overall. It's just so bad. We're 10 and 20 right now, guys. 30 games in, we've only won 10. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. Well, that's not bad. You know, you're, you're in the 15th spot in the conference, you know. But our last 10, we only got three wins. We're we're the 24th overall team in the league right now. And I know if I do play these games up until the All-Star break, we will definitely come back. We'll probably be like leading our uh, entire division, which is the Atlantic division. So I'm, I might just do that, man. I might just lead our Atlantic division over the Celtics, which in fact, I think the Raptors or the, um, yeah, well, the Raptors or the Nets should be leading, but. I guess the Celtics must have like a crazy team. I'll probably look into their roster after, uh, you know, probably right after All-Star break just to see who they got, who they did acquire or, or let go. Because I don't know why they lead in our division. They should be like dead last with us. But it's cool. This is IKC signing out. Thank you guys for watching. Peace. Yeah.